It was good to be back out here, be with the guys, um, have some fun with guys that you know you haven't been around in a while, and see some new guys, and get rained on a little bit. Did you have a chance to talk to one of the new guys in particular, Mason Bell? Uh, talked to as many guys as I could. Uh, there's a there's a lot of people here, a lot of new faces. Um, obviously, we're in meetings and stuff, and tried to help him out with a couple of things I saw out there. Has he asked you any questions yet? You said no, he hasn't asked me anything, but I, I I I inputted my two cents, so I hope he was okay with it. <laughs> Would you tell? Has something changed? I mean, you said in the off a couple weeks ago that you plan on playing a few more years. And last fall was like, I'm going to take it on your face. I'm just wondering, is there any, has there been any sort of change in your mindset? If it's the fire we um, I think just, uh, you know, being excited about the group we have, uh, the linemen in particular in front of me. Uh, having those guys back always makes me feel good because I'm, I'm healthy and just lots of prayers and spending time with family. I'm still going to take it one year at a time, but just feeling like you, what you have left in the tank. What would you offer, Mason? Uh, you know what, um, there, was a, there was a particular play that he ran a little naked on, and he was probably six or seven yards from Rosie, and he threw it, threw it pretty hard at Rosie, threw it high, and Rosie didn't catch it. And, you know, Rosie's kind of a, a team favorite here, so the linemen started giving him a grief and stuff. And um, I just, you know, I just pulled him aside and said, hey, listen, you'll, you'll learn quickly that you don't have to, every throw doesn't have to be the hardest throw you can make. You don't have to put every, uh, every throw, like, on guys' chest as hard as you can. Like, that's a great opportunity to just give him a nice, easy touch pass. So just, just trying to instill little things like that. You have some first impressions of him? He's got a big arm. Um, he overthrew AB, even though AB's not going to admit it. <laughs> um, but uh, no, I thought, uh, you know, seems to understand the offense, seems to um, not have any issues in the huddle, so I thought you did really well. Ben, how are you, how you feeling? You look like you're having fun. Yeah, it was fun today. Uh, it's fun to get back out here. You know, it's um, to be around the guys, to laugh, smile, and, um, you know, throw the football around is, is always fun. Do you have any flashbacks to your first one here by watching him? Wow, uh, a long time ago. <laughs> <laughs> um, you know, you can see a little bit. Um, you know, and what I probably remember too is just that kind of the big eyes. You know, sometimes when things are going and uh, you see how fast it is, and, and, and I'm going to enjoy telling him that, hey, this isn't even as fast as it gets yet. You know, pads on get a little faster, preseason gets a little faster. So uh, I, I think that's probably one of the biggest things that I can, you know, see in him that I probably had too. A lot of interaction with uh, Ryan Shazier between you guys. How nice is it to have him out here participating in, in the way that he can? Oh, it's great. Um, it's great to see him out here. It's great to to have fun with him, to laugh with him. Um, and uh, I told him that he's trying to give our plays away because he was I had his car on the sideline and I had to tell him to move because we were throwing an out route there. And so now the whole defense knew where we were throwing it. So I told him he was doing it on purpose to help the defense. Ben, how do you guys uh, offset the loss of Martavis collectively? Um, you know what, that's a it's a big play guy, a weapon that, that we had that, that did a lot of great things for us. But, but you don't ever try and, when you lose a guy, you don't ever try and replace him. You just let other guys do their jobs. And, um, you know, we've got one of the best in the business already still here. And we've got other guys that are going to step up and try and do their job as well. And has the playbook changed much from, from Todd to Randy? It is completely new. <laughs> Aren't we playing the Browns the first game, right? Yeah. Right? So it's completely new offense. A lot of the stars aren't coming out to these OTAs around the league, Brady and Gronk and some guys. What made you come? Oh, to, to be here to have fun, to be around the guys. Um, never would have heard the end of it from Pouncey if I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> um, but, but no, just to be out here to have fun. And it's day one. It's, it's good to get out here. Surprise Brady not showing up for theirs? Uh, I think he can do whatever he wants. <laughs> Man, it sounds like you are open to, to helping the young quarterback or the young quarterbacks. In yeah, I always, I always have. I always, always done that. I think people took some things that I said into a context that I was going to be mean or rude or whatever, and that was not it at all. If you listen to the whole conversation, that was said in just and laughing and having fun. So I've never been the type to just um, be rude or mean to other quarterbacks. So you can ask, you know, Jones. And I've had a lot of quarterbacks through here that have been younger than me that I've tried to help any way that I can. So, um, you know, I'll, I'll continue to do that. With uh, Levy on not here, what do you think about the guys that are here? They're kind of what does this do for them? To help you know, this is a big this is a big time for James um, with some of the injuries that he had um, last year and learning last year. I think this will be really good for him to get as many reps as possible, um, so we can all see what he can do and he and, and that he can see what he can do too. What are your early thoughts on James Washington? Well, it's real early. Um, you know, threw to him a little bit in an in individual. Um, saw him make cold plays. Uh, looks a little raw. You know, got to got to tighten up some things, his arms and, and some things um, in terms of kind of wide receiver route running. But uh, boy, the way he, he snatches the ball and plays big, it, it looks pretty impressive so far. Did you have your passing week thing with some of your receivers this year? No, not, uh, not, we haven't done it yet. We might end up doing it uh, after this, after the, the mini camp.